Good evening, and welcome to Kevin's Ghost Box Sessions. I am your host, Kevin Benich. I want to welcome you to Season 4. This is the first episode. Instead of doing something in front of my desk, we decided to do something completely different. We decided to go on to location to get the best Ghost Box Sessions. For this year's sessions, we're going to choose, leave a comment, your own personal question, down in the comments below. We will pick one question out of all the comments and we'll ask that on your behalf on our next Ghost Box Sessions. So please join me for a trip to the ethereal plane. I want to introduce my special guest who's going to be helping me with my ghost box videos. It's Bryce Camp. Introduce yourself. Hi. Bryce has been helping me with my videos and some of my investigations since the early 2012. So naturally, he was one of the first people that I asked you to come back and give me a hand with my new ghost box sessions. I'm actually pretty well with handling cameras, so... So it's just me and him, as, as far as you know, because I just don't want you guys to think, you know, obviously he had a cameraman, so there you have it. Just didn't want to hide anything, inf any information, but we are about to be in our current location here. Then we'll do the ghost box session. I do have a digital voice recorder just in case. So if you think the audio is a little clear when I'm far away, now you know why. Uh, this way. <sighs> we'll have to cut a section out of that. Hey, hey Whitney. What a man really believes seems to him to be really true, but to that does not make it so except to his mind. I don't know who said that, but there you go. It was on a headstone. It was on a headstone. It has to have some form of wisdom on it, right? And Bryce on slip on his butt. I'm still sliding. One more we're coming up to? Yeah, it's just right over here. Right yeah, one more we're up. coming up to. Uh, we are coming up to... John D. Kendrick. Oh, Kendrick. <laughs> That's going to be left in. That's going to be left in. <laughs> I'm trying not to laugh. <laughs> Maybe that would be for the outtakes. We're coming. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Restart from here. All right. New take, baby. We're coming up across. Uh, we're coming up on. John D. Kendrick's gravesite. Get over here. This is where John Kendrick and his wife is buried. And across from us, across the valley, on where they can see their own house from the Kendrick bench, is the Kendrick mansion. Kendrick, Ma John D. Kendrick, and his family were the most prominent people here in Sheridan, Wyoming. It's somewhere over there. Right so. over there. Yeah, I don't have a clear view. Yeah, I can't get a clear view of it. I can. We can circle it because I know where we're at roughly. Yeah, we're just right across the way. Yeah. But anyways, uh, that's John B. Kennedy. My apologies, sir. I am so sorry. Kendricks were very prominent men. They were kind of the uh, multi billionaires here in Sharon, Wyoming. So 
Bryce, what do you think it would be that we do a ghost bike session here? Start here. Yeah, let's start. All right. Hold on, give me a second. Let me zoom out. Yeah, let's start. Let's actually start with you in between the two. I think that'd be a good shot. I think it will be. Mr. and Mrs. Kendrick, would it be okay if I would try to make communication with you today? I have a special device that would make a two-way conversation. My name is Kevin Benage. I would classify it as an honor if I would be able to speak with you today. Is it okay if you and I hold a conversation? Okay, no EVP, so I don't know. We'll, we'll try it. Uh, standard ghost box, uh, same device as you guys are pretty much familiar with from the first three seasons. I don't know if the season three was actually really real because I only had like two episodes, maybe three. But yes. anyways, regardless, we're, we are on our fourth season. And I apologize. Chilly. Hello, anybody here with us? It is cold. My name is Kevin Benich and this is Bryce. How are you doing today? What color is my jacket? We're trying to establish some words here so we can pick, pick you out. Hello, is there anybody here? Does anybody want to make communication with me? You do? Who are you? What's your name? What color is my jacket? Are you here with me? You are. What color is my jacket? Can you say hi, Kevin, real clearly, please? What the hell was that? Did you hear that? Are we disturbing you? Yeah. Alright, we'll move on. Alright, well, I guess we'll move. And... Cut.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, for any no further ado, I do want to introduce someone. Bryce Campbell could not come up and finish the episode with me uh, today. Uh, so in the meantime, I went and contacted one of my old cameramen, Jason Canfield. Um, he, uh, Hi. Uh, Jason has accompanied me on many other types of investigations, and he did some fabulous work, so he was more than happy to come up and say, well, he, he would help uh, Bryce out, Mr. Campbell, out for filming. So without any further ado, it's getting real cold, and we're about to lose some daylight again. That's why we kind of had to stop the last yesterday's session. We just ran out of light. So that's why we're up here doing this one again on DT. Uh, anyways, I will conduct the ghost box session one more time. Uh, I am pr producing this on FM, not AM. Uh, the reason why, if you've seen some of my previous uh, videos on why I do not do AM is because of the clicking sound. Because of this. I'll just let you listen to it. It's because of that sound. I cannot stand it. It kind of blocks out the frequencies a little bit. And I, it, it's just... It's just a mess. It's just a mess. It's hard to clean up, and so I do FM. All right. Hello. Is anybody here? My name is Kevin Bennett. How are you? You can get closer than that if you want, Jace. Digital voice recorder. I always have one of these for backups for audios. I just now remembered to turn it on. Life of a ghost hunter. Not. Hello, my name is Kevin. Is anybody here with us? If you're here with me, can you say Kevin real quick? Cold. Cold. Keep in mind, it was warmer yesterday, even though I was not up here. What color was my uh, coat? people talk to me if you're here say hi Jason can you say hi Jason can you say hi to Jason please that's enough you want me to stop I'm just here to make communication with you. I'm trying to. I'm, I'm, we don't mean you no harm. I've been coming up here for years to collect evidence of the uh, afterlife. If you don't want me to be up here, tell me, Kevin, please stop, and I'll stop. I'll turn the camera off, I'll go home. Alright, so I got one saying, do or someone don't, so... I personally believe it's important if... There is a way for, to communicate for someone who has physically passed. I think it's important for us to make communication this way.
for this season, for the series of videos that I'm going to be doing, I want to make sure that there is proof of the afterlife. That is my goal. But regardless on what type of evidence that I produce, it's going to be, you know, people are going to have their fans saying it's fake or not. But for those people who have been watching my videos and who understand the process on how I do my videos, I want to be able to teach them that yes, there is an afterlife. Can you please verify that there is an afterlife? I'm sorry if I don't hear you right away. When I play this video back, I might be able to pick you up. Or I might be able to pick you up on this uh, audio device here. So on a pleasant note, did your folks have a wonderful New Year's? Does anybody else want to talk to me over here? Anybody's looking to talk to me. Say hi to Jason. He feels a little lonely. Merry Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Even though it's it's a little it's a little late for Christmas, but Merry Christmas. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> Did you hear that? He said Merry Christmas. Well, Happy New Year. I heard that one playing his day. Who is who said Merry Christmas? What what's your name, sir? It's like January 20th. Why would the radio say Merry Christmas out after that? I don't know. That's a little weird. <laughs> Am I talking too much? Is that why you called me a bastard? <laughs> Be nice now. Be nice. You want me to shut up? Is that it? <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm coming off strong. I just, I'm just very passionate about this topic. I, I mean no disrespect, it's just... Or an, as an insult, I don't mean it as an insult. I apologize if that's what's coming by. I'm just very passionate about it. Well, it's starting to get late and I'm starting to lose some some light here, so I apologize if I have to cut this in real shortly. Please re be at peace, and if you said anything to confirm anything, I appreciate it. It's an honor to speak with you. Thank you. Have a pleasant evening and good night. Thank you. Alright, good night. Okay, let's go back to the car. It's cool. And there you have it, the first episode of season four. My name is Kevin Benich. I would like to thank Bryce Campbell for the first day of shot and Jason Canfield for the second day of shot. You guys are really awesome. Uh, thank you for the support. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button. And on a personal note, you know, if you guys wouldn't have, you know, handed me to make another another Ghost Box session video, I probably wouldn't have done it. 
So honestly, deep down in the bottom of my heart, I want to thank you for supporting me over the years and after when I went through my health issues. You don't need to know any about that. But anyways, thanks again for watching. Keep posted on to my next one. Uh, I'll have it up as soon as I can. This is Kevin signing off. Thank you very much.